Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're just gonna do a chill little Sephora slash also Nordstrom haul. I went holiday shopping for others, but like mostly myself. I mean, seriously, like if there's a good makeup deal, if there's just a good deal in general on something that I want, like I have a shopping problem and I will just buy it. So a lot of this is for me, a lot of this is for others. If you are a loved one in my life, <coughs> Gianna, don't watch this video, just click out because I'm gonna show some of your gifts in here, sis. Just click out, okay? I know you support me, I love you. Just click out of this video. I did um, some damage at Sephora, not as much damage as I have done in the past. I didn't do that much damage at Nordstrom, but all in all, it is still considered damage. My name is Fortune. If you're new here, I'm a certified professional makeup artist. I love beauty, makeup, skincare. I really just love some self love, self care. I love feeling my best, looking my best. And if that's something that you're interested in, or you have a shopping problem, honestly, then you and I will really get along. So make sure that you subscribe and click that bell. This way you get a notification every time I'm uploading a video here on my channel. I've been uploading a lot, guys. I'm very proud of myself. And I know some of you are as well. And thank you so much for the kind messages. I love the encouragement. It means a lot because some days I just wake up and don't feel like, you know, going on with anything. So here we are. Thank you. Love you. Let's, let's, dive into the things that I bought. Let's talk about the product that I did a video on, which is the Iconic Mini Lip Wardrobe by Charlotte Tilbury. You get four mini lipsticks. I'm not gonna talk about this too much because I did a whole damn video on it, which I will link above, but really cute, great size, beautiful component. The lipstick stays inside, which is an A++ because <coughs> Pat McGrath. You get Pillow Talk, Pillow Talk Medium, Walk of No Shame and Red Carpet Red. I'm wearing Red Carpet Red, but if you wanna watch it, I will put the video here as well as down below and I will show you all four of these lipsticks swatched on my lips. I've been dying to try, but I don't need it. So this is a gift for someone. This is the Skin Fix Barrier Plus Triple Lipid Peptide Cream. It's a really pretty blue color. Love it, super bright. My hands are clean, okay? I'm giving this to someone, this is not for me. You push it down and it gives you like the perfect amount. It gives you like a dollop. And if she loves it. When I need a moisturizer, I'll buy it. So, you know, kind of selfishly a purchase, but she did tell me that she wants a moisturizer. Why wouldn't I buy one that I want to try? Why wouldn't I buy her one that I want to try, you know? It just makes the most logical sense. Reusable kind of makeup wipe that is SpongeBob themed. It has all different characters. I'm not going to take it out of the box, okay? Super cute, but um, I have a makeup eraser, I've never tried it. So this is kind of like a bold purchase for me to give to someone as a beauty lover, you know, considering I've never tried it, but I've heard good things about it. I should try the one that I have. I have like a regular schmegular one that Mike's sister gave to me. It's just like the OG makeup eraser. I'll, I'll try that tonight and I'll report back. Sammy Cheeks as Sunday, Squidward Tentacles as Monday, Tuesday is Gary, Wednesday is SpongeBob, Thursday is Patrick, Eugene Crab. I didn't know his name. Oh, I did know his name was Eugene, Mr. Krabs, and then Plankton. So yeah, super cute. Have someone in your life that is a SpongeBob and also a makeup fan, why not buy it for them? Ferulic Brew Rejuvenating Facial Essence. I bought this for myself. I love Kiehl's, Mike loves Kiehl's. We're just like a Kiehl's family. And I just need something that's going to exfoliate my skin, but something that I'm gonna use because honestly, a lot of the exfoliators that I have, I really don't enjoy using them, but I need like a chemical exfoliator and I use Kiehl's every night. I use my Midnight Recovery Concentrate. That's something that I love so much and just something that I just gravitate towards, honestly. So I bought this because it's kind of like the same, kind of like the same packaging. So I just thought that this would be nice. Absorbs quickly into the skin to reduce fine lines, rejuvenate skin's texture, and boost healthy radiance. It's enriched with acid, visibly renew skin and improve signs of aging. I haven't used this yet, but I'm gonna wash my face and then I'm gonna put this on right after it. Probably put a couple drops in my hands, press my hands together and then apply it to my face and then go in with my serum, moisturizer, eye cream and all that stuff. But I'll let you know how this is, but it got really good reviews. If you are someone that is like me, you should buy yourself this. Soy face cleanser, love it, so good. And I'm actually running out of the one that's in my shower. So every Sephora sale or any kind of sale, I think of the things that I repurchase all the time. And soy face cleanser is definitely one of them for me by Fresh. So now that it's the holidays, they have a lot of like gift 
packages. So this one has the soy face cleanser and then it comes with the rose face mask, which I also love. Definitely don't need to open this because I have a big jar, but you guys have seen I own that really, really big jar. I'm probably gonna run out of that soon. So this would just be a really good backup to have. And I bought both of them for $19.50 and it's a $30 value. And I honestly, oh, damn it. I thought this was like the really, really big face wash and it's not, damn it. Okay, so it's a smaller one, definitely. I have the huge one in my shower. I just like how big it is because I feel like it's never ending. But so I was gonna say, this is like such a steal because the soy face cleanser, the size that I have is like, I thought it was like $35, $40 for the big ass one, but this isn't the big ass one, but still, I'm excited about it. Not as excited if it were the bigger one, but I need to learn how to read. So, might be. I am so excited for this. And I specifically bought this because it was huge. So you know that I read the description on this, but oh my God, this is the Biggie Biggie Bum Bum Cream. I freaking love Bum Bum Cream. I always buy it insert picture of the one that I usually get, which this tub is pretty big and it lasts me a pretty long time. But again, you guys know, if you watch my channel, I always, I only always just use it on my butt and like my thighs. I can't use this all over my body. It's just too rich and heavy and I'm a sweaty thing. Um, but I'm running out. I didn't have any more backup, which honestly to me was insane because I feel like every Sephora VIB sale, I buy like two or three of these. So that's how you know that I love it. Look at how huge this is. Not only is this huge and will last me forever, but it has really cute packaging. It has like a sun and a mermaid and it's just super cute. And I'm so excited because I know that I'm gonna use it, but it also comes with this little scooper, which is so exciting to me because I cannot tell you like how many times, this is such a thick moisturizer and it gets stuck underneath my nails. And then like, I'll be downstairs and Mike and I'll be eating like popcorn or something and my pop popcorn tastes like boom boom cream like gross so I was really excited to buy this scooper could I have just taken something else that I owned and used it as a scooper in the current tub that I have yes but I'm running out of bum bum cream and I needed it so that's that if you don't know about this if you don't know about this it helps to reduce the look of cellulite it kind of just plumps the skin honestly makes the skin look so much tighter I'll insert a video up here. You can see before and after pictures um, of my bum after I used it for like a good 90 days. So yeah, check that video out. But if you have not tried this, you need to try it. Game changing. I look forward to my showers. It's just because of this cream. And it just makes me feel like, even though it makes the slightest difference, it makes me feel like 100% better in my own skin, which is amazing in and of itself. Like that's worth any, well not any, but you know, I'll spend 50, 60, $70 to feel a hundred times better. No, I am gonna keep this. No, I'm not gonna keep this actually. I told you, a uh, Lancome Lashy Doll. So this is the ones from Sephora. My aunt bought me one because Ulta had a 40% off sale. I had already bought one in the Sephora sale, so it just got here because, you know, shipping problems. So I'm gonna return this one because I got this one at 20% off and now it's on sale at Sephora for like $19. And I think I paid like 23, maybe 24. Let's be honest, I love this mascara, but I'm probably gonna try other ones. Going through two full tubes of this because I have one right here that's on its last leg, but I've used every single ounce. Like, oh wait, no, and this is a trial size one. So I'm the full size one, very exciting, but I'm gonna return it because I don't need to, um, do I? I don't, I don't need two backups, I don't, I don't. Well, honestly, it would only be one backup because I'm about to open one. I'll just return it. Pharmacy Green Clean Makeup Removing Balm. It's like a solid oil, I love it. I've talked about it so many times here on my channel. This is, I double cleanse my face. This is the first thing I use to take all my makeup off at night, every night. No matter if I'm wearing a full face of makeup or little makeup, I always use this to take off my mascara, just any makeup, any makeup on my face, this takes it off. And then I follow up with the fresh soy face cleanser that I purchased the wrong size of, which I'm still a little like better about, but whatever. So I bought this because I ran out of back stock and I'm running low. So just repurchase the things that I use all the time. And this is a product that I use literally every day. My skin is just so dry. It's uncomfortable how dry my skin is. And it's wild. It's just crazy to see how my skin goes from not perfect, but like 
near perfect in the summer to like miserable and burning in the winter. So this is the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Ultra Fine Mist. I just wanted this honestly because it looks really pretty. I'm not going to take it out though because I honestly might give this to someone as a gift. I haven't really decided. I have a ton of Morphe Continuous Setting Sprays. I don't need this but then I was thinking like maybe I'll give them a Morphe Continuous Setting Spray and I'll try this because my skin is so dry and I love setting sprays that's why i have so many backups of them because i use them every single day no matter if i'm wearing makeup or not it just feels nice on my skin and it just throws a little extra layer of hydration so tbd but if i try this or if someone else tries this either way i will give you the feedback those are all my sephora things let's move on to nordstrom really quick Here's my little Nordstrom bag. I bought a bunch of holiday gifts. I saw this at Nordstrom. This is the Laura Mercier Shimmer and Glow Caviar Stick Trio. It comes with three different shades. So we have one that's cocoa that is like this beautiful, it looks like a matte brown. Oh my God, I would love to get this as a gift, honestly. I have Amethyst as well, which is kind of like a bronzy purple tone and then last but not least we have copper which i would personally love love this this is a really good shade but this is a cute like highlight shade you can put this in the inner corner underneath the brow bone blends it in if you don't know what these are these are basically like eyeshadow sticks i bought two packages of these and I bought a package of the Pillow Talk. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these gift sets and I'm gonna mix and match some of the products and then I'm gonna throw them in these really cute like Santa bags that Mike and I bought. Oh my God, this is so cute. Refresh Rose. These are just lip glosses. This one is Pillow Talk, which I already own, but I can't find it. I lost it. I have no idea where it is. I need to find that. And then this is Walk of No Shame, which is super pretty too. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mix and match these things. So I might throw this in a gift bag with one of the Laura Mercier caviar sticks. And then last but not least, I just bought like a bunch of little MAC nudes, like nude lipsticks. Who doesn't love a nude lipstick? Like if someone gave me any of these things in a cute little pink Santa bag, insert adorable photo slash video, whatever here. Like I would be so excited, no. So I have a bunch of different shades. I have Mare, Whirl, Twig, Velvet Teddy. I bought a bunch of things that I would like to receive. And if I come across someone whom I want to give a gift to, I'm giving the gift of lips and eyes. LP is lip, no, LP, what the fuck's a P? Lips is an L, eyes is an E. The gifts, the gifts of Lee. I have no idea what I'm saying, but um, yeah, it's gonna be cute. And I'm just in the mood to like give things. So those are all of the things that I mostly purchase. No, that's not true. I mostly purchase for other people. Like a good 50-50, a good 50-50, whatever. Anyway, so those are the gifts that I purchased from Sephora and Nordstrom. If you guys enjoyed this haul video and you would like to see more haul videos, which I'm trying to not buy things, so that might be nearly impossible, but I am gonna get gifts for Christmas. We could do like a Christmas haul, you know, something like that. So yeah, if you like it, let me know by leaving it a thumbs up. Do you own any of these things? What are you buying for those you love this holiday season? What are you buying for yourself? Let a girl know. I would love to hear. Make sure that you subscribe and click that bell before you leave. I had a wonderful time as always. Thank you guys so much for joining me and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys. Mwah.